Say it with a little more feeling. Come on here. <laughs> BuzzFeed started in New York, in this little office in Chinatown. The first company I ever worked at was Huffington Post, which I started with Ariana Huffington and, and Ken Lair. And I learned a huge amount from the two of them, and, and also from Eric Hippo, who became CEO of, of Huffington Post. I learned from Ariana that, that people really matter, and, and connections with people are, are really important in a startup or a business or in life. <laughs> and I learned from, from Eric Hippo that Getting out of the weeds and seeing the big picture and delegating is really important. I watched him as CEO of Huffington Post and he was tremendous at that. And then I learned from Ken Lair that sometimes you get totally down in the weeds and try to fix something that's broken or go after an opportunity. And so I take kind of synthesize those three things and I feel like um, now as CEO of BuzzFeed, taking those pieces and putting them together has been really valuable. The way ideas spread, people get confused and think it's about a platform or think it's about media or particular format or particular type of content, but really the key is connecting with a person and then people connecting with each other. So I always think people should do the thought experiment when they make something or create something, they should look at it, whether it's an idea, piece of media, whatever it is, they should look at it and say, would I want to tell someone else about this? If so, that's a really good sign that it, someone else might then want to share it with their friend. And, and that's really been the key for us. Why, why would someone care about this and why would it connect with them and then would they share it? The hardest part about making an organization data-driven is, is that you can't run an entire company off of data. So you, you need to have human judgment and human insight. And so that causes people to then not trust data at all because there's they see examples where, where the data leads you astray. And the, the hardest thing is to, is to really value data but also be skeptical of it and constantly test your assumptions and to combine human creativity and human judgment with data. And so for us at BuzzFeed, a lot of what we focus on is having really smart, creative people who are seeing lots of data and then reacting to it with their own creative ideas, having a really tight connection between human creativity and data and, and using them together is always the, the biggest challenge, but also the biggest opportunity. Uh, I'm Jonah Peretti, and it's been great writing with you.